friends, welcome back to Tranquility Moms. My name is Coach Kathy and today I am answering your questions. Hi Coach Kathy, I read on the blog that you have a morning spiritual routine that relaxes you on vacation. Can you tell me what you do and how I can get started? Thanks, Diane. Great question, Diane. You know, it is, it's, it's a routine I started at home and then it was just so relaxing and such a kickstart to the morning that I did continue it on vacation. Now, at home, I do choose to wake up earlier before the kids. They're older now in elementary school, and so it does give me a chance to just have a quiet moment before they need something, before they're asking for something, before they're doing something, that it just gives me that little bit of quiet time reflection, time to just sort of set the tone of my day. And it puts me in such a better mood for them and for me and for really how the whole outcome of the day is going to go. So waking up a little bit early on vacation, they're kind of slow moving in the morning anyway. So it gives me a chance once I've got my little bag of supplies, I am able to um, just start that even if they're still sitting on the couch or they're in their beds. I sit and I read a devotional. Now, the first part that I do is whether I bring my Bible with me or I also have the YouVersion Bible app on my phone. If I bring my Bible, it's my Candace Cameron Buer Bible, and I'll put the link down below to her Dayspring Bible. If I use the phone, then I've got my YouVersion Bible app and I'm able to open up the scripture I'm able to open up my devotionals. And that's the second part of morning is that I'm reading the word. I am sitting and just taking in the messages of scripture, what happened thousands of years ago, how it applies to now, how family and motherhood and my heart and what my calling is, is all tied in and that God's word and his message to us still stands true today. If I'm weary and tired, it helps me to know what to pray for, who to pray for, which is another part of my morning routine. Maybe today I'm praying over my husband, that he has a good meeting, a good appointment, something goes well for him, that he's calm and he sees how much we appreciate him in our family. Maybe I'm praying for one of the kids that they're really struggling with a friend and they need God and the Holy Spirit to be in their heart as to how they're going to problem solve the situation, how they can rise above and be a great leader and a great friend. Maybe I'm saying my prayers of gratitude in the morning. Thank you for this beautiful sunrise. Thank you for us being on vacation, being together. Thank you, God, for our health and our wealth and each other. Thank you, God, for this beautiful location, the surroundings, the scenery, the nature that we have been able to experience. That sets my heart in a happy tone. I'm looking for more joyful things to find throughout the day when I started out with gratitude. Maybe I'm putting in a request. Oof, we've got a long day ahead of us. Help us all to have patience with each other. We're going to be out and about. Help us, you know, sometimes it's the weather. Help us to have good weather today. We've got all outdoor activities planned. That's where I'm talking and sitting in prayer and conversation with the Lord. I'm also journaling on a lot of mornings and whether that's in my Tranquility Journal Notebook, right? You've seen this that my daughter and I designed. It's blank lined pages, super cute, just fits in my beach bag or my purse. If I'm sitting and writing, maybe it's to release thoughts, worries, concerns, to-do lists, or I'm on vacation and I wanna write down those special memories, those cute little moments and stories and treasures that the kids are finding and talking about as we're all spending this quality time together. Those aspects are all part of my morning routine. What do you do for morning routine? What do you feel like is calming? I like to go for a morning walk if that fits into the schedule. That gets me moving and fresh and clearing my head, taking in a good clean breath, taking in nature. So going on that walk and it gives me that chance to touch base with nature. And sometimes it even lends me to my word of the day, right? Maybe there's a word of joy 
or sunshine, delight, or love. And then I carry that theme all throughout my morning into my afternoon, into the evening, the entire day through. I hope this helps you. Put in the comments down below, are there other things that you do for your morning routine? Share with our community of moms. Here on Tranquility Moms, we talk about family and faith, travel and wellness. We talk on YouTube every week. We have our blogs, our Instagram, and our Facebook community. Please join us. We invite you to subscribe to the channel. That gives you a chance to see each of the videos that we put out. Give us a thumbs up. That is the best compliment that you can give to us. I'm Coach Kathy, and today, take care of yourself.